Today we will learn how to find the cube root of an imperfect cube in seconds. An imperfect cube is when a cube is not a product of three equal integers. For example, when we multiply a whole number 5 three times, we get 125. But when we multiply a decimal number 4.93 times, we get 123. So 123 is an imperfect cube. The cube root of an imperfect cube will always be in fraction or decimal and never a whole number. For example, cube root of 27 is a whole number 3, but cube root of 11 is decimal number 2.4. We will start with the most important thing for this concept, cubes from 1 till 10. It will be very helpful to you if you can memorize this chart. 1 cube is 1, 2 cube is 8, 3 cube is 27, and so on and so forth. Here we have to find the cube root of 12. Referring to our cheat sheet, we can see that the closest cube to 12 is 8. The corresponding number to 8 is 2, so we will write 2 in the equation box. Next, we have to find the difference between 12 and 8. So 12 minus 8 is plus 4. Since 12 is more than the cube 8, we will add 4 to 2. Moving on, we will divide 4 by 3. This 3 is common in all questions, meaning we will always divide by 3 only. Now we will find the square of 2. So square of 2 is 4. We will multiply that to 3. So our equation is now complete. All we need to do is solve it to get our answer. 3 times 4 is 12. 4 divided by 12 is equal to 0 0.33. 2 plus 0 0.33 is 2.33. So, the cube root of 12 is 2.33. In this example, we have to find the cube root of 61. Again, from our cheat sheet, we can see that the closest cube to 61 is 64 and the corresponding number is 4. We will write 4 in the equation box. Next, 61 minus 64 is equal to minus 3. Since 61 is less than the cube 64, we will subtract it from 4. Next, we will divide 3 by 3. We will find the square of 4, which is 16, and multiply that to 3. Now, we just need to solve the equation to get the answer. 3 times 16 is 48. 3 divided by 48 is 0 0.06. 4 minus 0 0.06 is 3.94. So, the final answer is 3.94. Here we have few questions in the practice quiz for you to solve on your own. You can pause the video and take your time. After each question, you will find the answer and explanation. Quiz 1. What is the cube root of 29? You can choose your answer from these options. This is the answer and explanation for quiz 1. Quiz 2. What is the cube root of 18? And here are your options. Here is the answer and explanation for quiz 2. Quiz 3. What is the cube root of 67? And this is the answer and explanation for quiz 3. Quiz 
Let us end the chapter with a very profound and practical quotation by Dr. A.P.J. Abdul Kalam. You cannot change your future, but you can change your habits. And your habits will change your future. Thank you and take care.